In this video, we demonstrate a fast and accurate GPU level set method for image segmentation in two and three dimensions. Our GPU level set method is able to quickly segment 2D and 3D objects from noisy images such as this classic test image. The user can select small seed points from which our GPU level set method will grow to capture object boundaries. Or the user may highlight a large area of the image from which our GPU level set method will contract to the object boundaries. Existing GPU level set methods are unable to correctly segment these objects. Our GPU level set method is able to capture objects even when the mean intensity of the object is equal to that of the background. In this image, our shape only differs from the background in terms of intensity variance. By using our interactive brushes, the user is able to select very specific areas to segment. For example, in this 3D MRI data, we may choose to segment just the first and second ventricles. Note that this segmentation is shown in real time on a high-end GPU. And now we can add the third ventricle. Alternatively, we may choose to segment the cerebellum or, by tuning in our three intuitive parameters, capture the whole brain structure, from the white matter areas in the center through to the convoluted surface of the cerebral cortex, or gray matter. As you can see, our GPU level set method faithfully captures the intricate details of the human brain. For our next example, we move into the field of ophthalmology. This black column is a macular hole that is formed in the retina, shown in grey, of a patient. Ophthalmologists are interested in the size and shape of these holes, but standard segmentation methods are unable to distinguish between hole and background, as shown here. Our interactive brushes allow the user to select a no-grow area, shown in blue, and the user may cut into this area to define grow-only regions. Now our segmentation captures only the area of interest. And it's not just medical imaging that can benefit from our GPU level set method. See here a CT scan of an engine. By initiating our level set on a specific material, we are able to capture the shape of all parts of the engine made from that material. Our method also has application in the biosciences. You are now seeing an electron microscope tomography of the yeast isosome protein complex. Our method can easily segment individual layers such as this the PIL-1 LISP-1 filament layer. We are also able to capture the phospholipid ring, the space between the phospholipid layer and the filamentous layer, and we are able to distinguish these black structures which we believe to be imaging artefacts. Thank you for watching.